right in front of the Ritz Carlton. Ooh, ah. This is not where Ivana and I are staying, but the Ritz Carlton nonetheless. Now, I've just recently lost Ivana. We walked in the park and got the thing set up, and she is gone. So maybe we'll explore the park on our own and see if we can find the lovely Ivana. As usual, let us know where you're watching from, everybody. I'm sure some Malaysians in the chat. Hopefully, we can pick up some Indonesians in the chat. As Yvonne and I are just starting our 30-day visa on arrival, so it should be pretty lively. We're hoping to shoot a video every day because Jakarta is... Seems like the city was built for vlogging because everyone is... Lots of action all around. Say again, Yvonne? This park is closed. park is closed? Yeah. No way. It's too bad. The whole park? Yeah. Oh, what a bummer. People are doing a silent protest in front of the park saying if you don't let me go in the park I'll sit right out front. Uh, so the park is huge. They call it the central park of Jakarta It's like right in the city and it's so close and yet so far Okay So with a uh, live stream happening, we're gonna have to reconvene our plan. Let's go walk this way and see what we can see uh, a bit of a bummer that the, the park is closed, but anyway so, shout out to DNK in the chat, as well as I saw RC Borneo there a minute ago. We've got Shaw, we've got all of our usual supporters, all of the people we know and love. Uh, Meja says, visit Sitayam Fashion Week. Actually, we accidentally stumbled into a fashion show in the street the other day. And so we do have some interesting stuff coming. Yes, that's the one, Chitayam. That's the one. Yeah. We stumbled into it by accident and... It was a bit like being in Brazil again. It was live music and it was uh, costumes and That's dancing. This is a few we could have gotten so from the park. We were hoping to go in the park and show you all this, but we literally jumped out of the car and turned the camera on and everything is closed, which is a bit of a bummer. Yeah, everyone so, came here to go picnicking, I guess, but... Everybody came. Those people <laughs> had the same idea as us and they all got blocked entry. So, we will figure out what to do in the meantime. Uh, what's your plan, Ivana? Any ideas? Pardon me? What can we do? I don't know. What should oh, we do? Oh, bummer. Should we... Let's walk around. Let's walk around. Okay. Okay, dokey. Which part of Jakarta is this? So, Ivana lives in South Jakarta, which is sort of away from the ocean. Or the South China Sea because Jakarta is on the north side of Java. So, South Jakarta, we are in. There is this huge park which is evidently brand new or newish yeah. and really nice. We've seen some photos that are really nice, but uh, oh, look how, look how close we can go. Go in, go in, go in, see what happens. We're gonna get yelled at. Oh, 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 getting yelled at. Tidak bole, Ivana. Tidak bole. Tidak bole. Can go? No. Cannot go. Okay. Thank you. Bummer. All right. Live stream fail. Okay. Bye bye. No, don't say bye bye yet. There's music over here. I see something over here. The live stream continues. Uh, we've got some kind of street festival over here, Ivana. I see people, I see action. I'm gonna go check it out. Let's see if we can find a live stream. Okay, so the theme of today's live stream is finding something to do when your first plan fails. The theme of the live stream is going to be plan B. Today is all about plan B. Now, let's see if we can uh, cross the road. Yeah, Kemarul Izam. So Ivana said the same thing. Ivana describes Jakarta as a little bit Tokyo, a little bit New York, and a little bit Sao Paulo. And also a little bit India. And also a little bit India. <laughs> it's like a, a merge of all those. So it's quite a good city for vlogging as well as for adventuring because 
you've got, like you want to said, India, New York, Tokyo, or Sao Paulo, depending on what you're interested in. Shout out to Casey Lou and shout out to Wee in the chat. Thanks for all your support, guys. We are going for 100 people in the live stream. I think we'd be doing a little better if the park was open, but this is life. This is life on the road. I think there's something over here, babe. Oh, there's the park there, but I think maybe they're building something for an event. Look at the park, it's so nice with the big buildings. Oh, I wanna go. I wanna go. I wanna go. <laughs> Shout out to Uno and Nikki in the chat, all of our usual suspects. Oh, thank you. So, I hear music over here. I see a KFC food truck. When's the last time you saw a KFC food truck? Did you ever see that before? Let me know in the chat if you guys have ever seen a KFC food truck. I have never seen that in my life. I didn't know KFC had food trucks. Look at that, Ivana. Is that interesting to you? Yeah. Very like interesting. Fresh. Smells like KFC right here in a food truck. Thumbs up. Nice guy. Hello from Brasilia, Brazil. Hope you guys come here sometime soon. So Ivana and I do have our plan. Now, our plan always changes. But it seems like... Um, after Indonesia, which is like 20, uh, 22 more days or so, we'll go to Romania. After Romania, we'll do some nearby countries, Serbia and stuff. And after Romania, we will be in Brazil for World Cup. So we want to watch the World Cup in Brazil. Obviously, the World Cup is not in Brazil, but naturally, Brazil is in the World Cup. So we are going to hopefully be in Brazil for the World Cup. We would love to come to Brasilia, so your wish might just be granted. Hello, no thank you. Selling They're selling tickets. tickets. Must be something here. Yeah. What ticket for? Ticket, ticket for the show. Yeah. Sepak Bole. Yeah. Uh, music. Oh, music. Uh, some kind of music show in here. It looks kind of interesting. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Bye bye. What's the story, babe? There's a music festival inside. Lots of Indonesian bands. Oh, maybe you can go. How much a uh, berapa for the ticket? Uh, 157 at the ticket box. And but the guy is saying I can sell it cheaper. <laughs> oh, he's got the fake tickets. Or the, I don't know. Stolen tickets or I don't know if it's real or fake. 157 is the number. So like 15 Canadian. Right. So like 12 bucks for an for Indonesian music festival. What do you guys say? Indonesian music festival? Let us know in the chat if you want us to walk around a bit more or go to Indonesian music festival. Maybe walk around. Maybe walk around a bit more. It might be hard to make a live stream in the music festival. It might be loud. Uh, let us know if we should go to the music festival. Okay, we've got a question from Krisan Alin. When are you coming to Romania? We should be there in like three weeks is our plan. But... Maybe five. Uh, well, the two week vacation don't count. We're not gonna post. I have an idea. Okay. Should be there after Indonesia. In Romania again. For autumn, the leaves change in color. And then after the leaves change color and it gets cold, we'll jump to Brazil for some uh, World Cup. This is our plan. But like I said earlier, our plan always changes. So, I think we can hear the music out here. Sort of interesting. Maybe we go music festival. Darn, live stream fail. We were, uh... We were hoping to go to the park, but the park is closed up. I'll tell you what, I've been outside for half an hour. I could really go for a cold drink. Woo! It's hot. Uh, you're not going to Singapore anymore. SK is Singapore, right? Oh, SK is South Korea. No, I, I oh. couldn't. I couldn't convince you. South Korea. Korea. <laughs> South Korea. We can, <laughs> but we have other plans. We have other plans. So I couldn't convince you from South Korea. I was hoping to, but I couldn't quite make it happen. Anyway, we'll walk around with you guys for an hour or something, and we'll talk to you, and we'll see what happens. Um, this is the nature of the live stream. 
our plan was to get to the park 20 minutes early, but then the Jakarta traffic happened, and so we showed up, turned the live stream on, and saw the sign saying Dilarang, Dilarang Masuk means no entry. Dodo is already in Indonesia. No, the Dodos are still in Malaysia, I believe. Going for 100 in the chat. So, thanks for joining everybody. Fred Marshall, he's at Damai Beach Resort. Shout out to Damai Beach Resort. Wow. Take some photos for us. Have a cold drink for us. Shout out to Damai Beach Resort. That's a relaxing place to be. Maybe we we'll go here, see some food trucks. Yeah. We'll try to find trucks. some. Uh, we'll try to find some thing to do. Uh, go to 1000 Islands. We'll be going there. Major oh, McCann, yeah. have a vlog idea for 1000 Islands. House Anthony is here. Shout out. Shout out to Anthony House. Hey, 100 in the chat. Thanks for joining, guys. Let us know any questions you have. We can do a Q and A okay, session. No, that can be one idea for this live stream. Now that our plan A failed. Plan B can be Q&A. Let us know any question you want. We will talk to you guys. Cold drink straight ahead. When in Jakarta, you need a cold drink. It is crazy hot. <laughs> it's funny that it's not actually that hot. It's only like 30 degrees, 32 or something. Yeah. But it's so humid. humid and the air quality is not that good. So you get so tired so quickly and you just feel like Ugh. And so, okay, we've got some park vibes here. This is somewhat parky. Ah, uh, the other park would have been so nice, guys. Okay, next week, we'll, maybe we'll do a redo next week if it's open. We can do a uh, park vlog. Let's get a minimum on. Let's get an iron dingin. We could go for an iron dingin. Oh, that's the stadium where they hold the football game. It looks very small from here. Behind yeah. all the trees. Oh, pen, pen. Okay, not bad. Let's go over there. Let's go over there. Oof. Are you guys at Mona's Tower? What's Mona's Tower, Ivana? Mona's the monument. Monument National. Mona's. Monument National. Monument National. Yo. Mona's. Indonesian people, I tell you what, these people are very busy. Because they don't even have time to say full words in Indonesian. Anytime you see a word, they just take the first couple letters of it and the next couple letters of the next word and smoosh it together. It's like a... It's like a... Where are you going, Ivana? Ivana's out of her mind. But it's like a, it's like a very common thing in Indonesia. They take two words and stick them together uh, just to make a new word. So Mona means Monument National. Mona's Tower. Uh, I'm not sure if we're near the Mona's Tower, but maybe. We're in some sort of South Jakarta beautiful area where you've got all type of clean and big buildings in the background. But the park that's just nearby is closed. Maybe this is Monument National. No, I don't think so. Indonesia is a hundred times better than Malaysia. Ah, oh, don't say stuff like that. Come on. Come on. Is Jakarta the same time as KL? Uh, no, it's one hour difference. So it's quite funny because in Kalimantan, it's Malaysia to the north and Indonesia to the south. And if you drive straight south, time changes by one hour. So usually east and west changes time, but there's a bit of a funny... Hello! Dad, where are you from? Canada. Say Daddy, Canada. Canada. Yeah. I'm from Java. Java. Yeah. What's your name? Yeah. My name is Theo. For the YouTube. YouTube. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Makasi, huh? Yeah. Uh, siapa nama? Your name? Theo. 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 And you? Theo. Yeah, you? How do you spell your name? T? T-I-O. Oh, Theo. My name's Theo. What? T-H-E-O. From Java. Jeling is Oppo. Jeling is Oppo. From Java. Ah, Jeling is Oppo. That's Japanese language. Japanese. Jeling is Oppo. Jeling is Oppo. You from Japan? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Nice guys. Oh, Javanese. Man, I always get Javanese mixed up with Japanese when people say it. 
Japanese. They say, oh, it's Japanese, and I go, it's because Japanese? <laughs> uh, okay, two nice guys, Tio and Theo. Um, I'm Theo, he's Tio. He was like, you Japanese. And then he started speaking in Jap <laughs> Japanese too. I'm like, oh, I don't know. He was speaking Japanese? Yeah. You're saying Japanese or Japanese? He spoke both languages. Oh, that's why. Shout out. Okay, there you have it. Some action for the live stream. So let us know, guys, what uh, any questions you have. A lot of people seem to be asking about our future travel plans. We certainly have booked our ticket from Indonesia, and we're going to Romania because we needed an outbound ticket on the way in. So it is going to be Romania vlogs after it is hot Indonesian vlogs. And we saw the drinks back there and we decided to not get a drink for we'll some reason. We'll go check out the stadium and then we'll go back. We'll go check out the stadium. I would love to see a Sepak Bole game, which is... Uh, bola, bola. Sepak Bola, <laughs> which is a football game in Indonesia. Ivana says Indonesian sports fans are the craziest in the world. Which I don't believe this. I figured it had to be South oh, America. Yeah. Um, if we go to a football game, I'd be scared. Really? I'd be very concerned. What kind of things happen at a football game? Violence. No. Yes. <laughs> like people punching each other in the head. People punching each other. They break the the gate, the the fences, Whoa. things like that. So we'll see. It will be interesting to go to a football game. I hope we can go. Actually. I hope we can go. Ivana, what would you say about air quality? It's okay for you? Uh, yeah, it's okay for me. Uh. What do you think? I always feel like I'm tired so easily because of air quality. Yeah. But maybe. I could be making this up. It could be okay. I the heat too. It's very hot. Maybe it's affecting the air quality as well. Uh. It's very hot. Don't you think so? Are you feeling tired right now, Steve? Yeah, I'm feeling tired. <laughs> if I go outside for half an hour in Jakarta, I feel tired. Uh, maybe people are jogging here uh, on the weekend. They're not around tired. this area. Because it's very quiet. It's a nice jogging place. Here, near the stadium in front of us. Okay, time to go check out the stadium at least. 130 people in the chat. Thanks for joining, guys. We really had a nice plan today, but pff, the park was closed. Any plans to go back to Albania? Yo, Albania is one of the most underrated, I think it's the most underrated travel country. Yeah. Albania is an amazing place. Uh, no plans to go back because uh, maybe we could though. If we're in Romania, we should do a couple weeks in Tirana. Albania is amazingly underrated because people think of Greece right next door or they think of Italy or something but Albania is really nice right? yeah you got Wood the mountains recommend. got the ocean sea, good beaches lakes, good food friendly people beautiful nature really nice history not yeah. good in terms of what happened but good in terms of learning about the history accessible and interesting history Very affordable. Uh, maybe when we're in Romania we'll jump over to the best pizza Best pizza in the world, Ivana says, which is a fact. Other than maybe, uh, Albania is Albania is the best because it's on every single street corner. Brazil, you got to go to the nice restaurant, but still very good. But Albania is uh, amazing pizza. Although to be clear, we have never been to Italy. Uh, Uno says, I've never been to Indonesia, but I've seen vids of Jakarta. It's always showing how crowded it is and you find the crowd very peaceful yeah interesting if you're the kind of person who likes cities jakarta is really nice city because the crowd very uno says the, it's like the crowds seem peaceful oh which would be my opposite analysis the crowds seem very anxiety inducing <laughs> yeah. uh, wow, but if, that's good. it's interesting right yeah if you're the kind of person that likes cities like you're a city person jakarta is an interesting place because it's got a little bit of everything and it's a huge city it's like more than 10 million people and so it's got, like Ivana said, it's got some part of Brazil to it with music and dancing and sort of free kind of happy people. It's got some part of New York to it with the tall buildings. It's got some part of Tokyo because some parts are quite rich and quite developed. And even some parts of India, which is where it's like stuff happening every which direction and uh, street markers and stuff. Okay, there you have it, guys. This is National Stadium. National Stadium. Oh, I think I misread. 
I think I miss Radio Uno's comment. She's saying it's not very peaceful. <laughs> Same like me. I'm like, yeah, that's kind of weird to find crowds pe peaceful. <gasps> Just watched your Kinabalu hike video, guys. You were so unlucky with the weather. Yeah, it was a bit of a bummer, but no problem. We'll try again next time. Uh, Indonesia and Malaysia are both on our list where we always come back. So... Actually, I want to go to Padang in Malaysia, uh, in Indonesia, sorry. Because Padang is the home of Nasi Padang and also the home of Rendang. So I would like to go to Padang next time, in Sumatra. Yeah. Now, I think this trip we'll just do Java, mostly Jakarta actually. I think next trip we should do Sumatra. Yeah. Because sure. Sumatra is the land of the food. All the good recipes, not all of them, but a lot of the good recipes come from uh, yeah. Sumatra. Okay, going for 150 people in the chat, hanging out with us. This is the stadium. Here we got the map. Looks like more trips to Mount Kinabalu in the future. Yeah, we'll have to try again. It was a bit of a fail. Ivana and I are not exactly quitters or giver-uppers, but in that one, we uh, we gave up because it was just too hard. Oh, they got everything over here. Archery, aquatic, yeah. history, this is baseball park. Right here. Baseball park? Let's go to the baseball park. Bole or no bole? Sure, so left, one, two, three. Three exits We're on the left. Here. We're over here. We're going to go over here. So let's go that way. Go check yeah, the baseball go. park. Oh, maybe the history. Want to go museum? Vote in the chat. Museum or baseball? I don't think this is a museum. Historia. Oh, really? Oh, no. Just history. Okay. Oh, Historia. That's the name of your building. That doesn't mean history? No. I just assumed that meant history. <laughs> history is... Historia. It's history. History. Historia. History. 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 Okay, let's go to baseball park. Okay, walk over here. Anyway, at the very least, we'll hang out with you guys for an hour or so. This is a very nice part of Jakarta. Uh, my first experience in Jakarta was obviously staying at Ivana's dad's place. We showed you that last live stream where it's just total chaos. And I sort of naively assumed that the entire 11 million people in Jakarta were living in a street market where it was crazy. And I just thought, man. Indonesians are tough or J Jakarta people are just used to this chaos uh, But obviously there's a lot more to Jakarta than just one Side the breeze so, is really nice right now. The temperature is good now yeah. and the breeze is coming in. We're in the shade quite nice So Ivana lives in the India part of Jakarta kind of India like <laughs> uh, we got some videos coming soon about uh, oh, there's a cafe The Tokyo there. part Coffee which is quite nice okay. okay, so the stadium's got some action in it. I guess it's open right now. There's no game, but there's people in there Looks jogging. massive. Cool. Uh, we've got a comment from Sunshine Girl. Hello, Jet Lag Warriors. Uh, found your channel through Luke D. Shout out to Luke D. Uh, where's Luke now? I forgot. Luke. I haven't talked to Luke in a while. Luke is our friend though. Luke is nice to be around because he's, uh, he's so young and so full of energy for travel. Mm -hmm. We hung out with Luke for like two weeks, maybe 10 days in Northern Pakistan. And we were just editing the whole time. We had so much work to do, and so did he. And so we were just editing and hanging out and playing cards and chilling. And right. Luke became Luke became my dear friend. Oh, <laughs> Dodo in the chat! Shout out from one friend to another. Shout out to the Dodos who say hello, guys. What's up? What's up? It's actually a nice looking stadium, don't uh -huh, you think? Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Pretty nice. Okay, pretty big. Guess the uh, capacity of the stadium. It's got to be 50,000 or more, no? I don't know. Does it look big to you or no? Pretty big. I mean, it looks big to me. Yeah. So, Mike and Gigi in the chat. Sunshine Girl says she saw the episodes. Uh, the bus chase. Remember North Vietnam uh, hitchhike challenge with Luke? Of course. That was good times. We <laughs> lost by like less than 20 minutes, I think, which is a bit of a shame. Miss you guys. Miss you in Ipo. The food isn't good without you. Wow. You bring the flavor. <laughs> Bro. Wow. Flavor bringers. That should go in our, should go in our bio. <laughs> Steve Gregg, traveler, vlogger, flavor bringer. So, shout out to this little area here. Just a simple little walk around the it's actually, it's stadium. A, it's not hot here. 
Is that like a breeze, some kind of a breeze here? It's quite nice. Yeah. Uh, the sun has gone away. We're in the shade. Whew. And I the breeze was is so out. People Shout out to Ozar Khan who says hello from Canada. Oh, hello, hello. Boom, ba. Hey, how is the Indonesian food? One day I will try it. Okay. Quick Indonesian to Malaysian food comparison. Uh, now, I'm going to give you some ideas that are in our upcoming videos, but I won't give you the whole thing because oh, there's a lot of videos coming. Okay, one, <laughs> Indonesian sambal is no joke. You really need to be cautious. Certain restaurants, they give you the sambal and it's not even edible. It's so <laughs> hot. It's literally one drop in your rice and your, and your mouth is on fire the whole meal. For me, it's so good. It's so good. I ate it, but my stomach cannot take it. I was going to say, local Indonesian, left the country for three years, <laughs> comes back and gets wicked stomach problems because you ate too many chilies. Yeah, and it's I go, so Dude, good. Ivana, it tastes so Ivana, good. Your stomach has been a bit Canadianized, okay? Yeah. So local Indonesian had stomach problems and I said, wow. <laughs> I was just avoiding the chili. That being said, the sambal is also, in my opinion, I'm sorry Malaysians, also better. One, they do not have sambal blachan. So well, I cannot we do eat. have sambal blachan. I've never seen but it. But it's not as common as in Not Malaysia, as common. I've maybe? never seen sambal blachan. They do have sambal kacang. Sambal kacang. Which is peanut sambal. Spicy yes. peanut sauce. Yes. So good. <laughs> as well as green sambal. <laughs> right. As well as sort of pickled sambal. The sambal is very good, but you really got to be yeah, you really got to be good. cautious and put one drop because it, it could <laughs> be an, it could be a situation where you so put good. half a spoon, you mix your rice and it's ruined. You cannot eat it. Yeah, green sambal is so good. The green sambal is amazing. I didn't see it in Malaysia. The green sambal is amazing. Uh, also, we did sambal. try a dish that was very similar to nasi lemak. Uh, it's called nasi uduk. Yeah. Stay tuned for the video comparing the two. You'll see which one I prefer. Uh, one of them, I will tell you this. One of them, nasi lemak or nasi uduk, one of them is way better than the other. Really? I won't tell you which. Uh, we also tried, that's about it so far. Eating nasi uduk a lot. Oh, bubur ayam. Bubur ayam, yes. Is it true that Indonesian food, not that burkua? What's burkua? Kua means soup. Soupy. It's not that soupy thing. Yeah, well, uno, depends. Uno. We got lots of soto <laughs> and bakso, which is berkuah. Bakso and soup. Or what do you mean by berkuah? Oh, you mean like the rendang is not that berkuah. The rendang is not berkuah. It's berkua. more dry. More like gravy-ish. Very thick uh, gravy. Also, the best breakfast in Indonesia is mm -hmm. bubur ayam. Yeah, so good. Yo, bubur is so good in the morning. It's so light. It's so yummy. It goes down so good. Yeah. Bubur ayam, which is rice that's been boiled for so long, the rice kind of disintegrates. Yes. Porridge that's rice. Right, that's with right. With chicken, that's with right. soy sauce, with a little bit of chili, with green onion. With kerupuk. What's that? The crunchy stuff. Oh, yeah. That was, oh, no, no, no. Uh, you mean rice crackers. Crackers, yes. Rice crackers. I don't know if it's rice or not. <laughs> I, uh, I don't like the word kerupuk. Because it Why? reminds me of Keropok Lekor, which I have But there I are many, many PTSD types of Keropok. Keropok. It's Lekor. not just Keropok Lekor, it's not actually Keropok. Keropok is supposed to be crunchy. I'm excited for the Indo journey. Shout out to Pico Pico Pico. Yeah, so we have a bit of a situation on our hands. We still have four more videos from Malaysia. And one idea would be to post them every day and get to Indonesia stuff. The other idea would be stick to our schedule three a week and mm -hmm. give us some more time. The reason we're thinking of ha going slowly because I sort of like the idea of being like a month ahead. Mm, yeah. Like what we're filming today gets released in a month. It's right. really peace of mind. It's really convenient for if you get robbed, don't say that again, or if we get sick, or if something happens, you know, luggage gets lost, whatever, we're not turning them over for the next day. We have a bit of PTSD. We got robbed in Peru, and not only did we lose all our stuff, we also could not post any videos for like two weeks. So mm -hmm. if we were two weeks ahead, we could have at least been earning some money. The way right. YouTube works is once you stop posting, you stop earning. So, at least on our channel it does. So, we're thinking of, you know, it'll be four more videos of Malaysia, which is like almost a week and a half. It's almost done, the Malaysian shark series. We got four more videos. I know yeah, people are asking, where is your Indonesian series coming? It's coming. It's oh, coming. Oh, did you replace the camera? That was sad. So, we actually got a free laptop from our friend in Malaysia. Yeah, shout out to which Jackie. Which is amazing. You'll see it in the next video. And also from Lenovo. Lenovo hooked us up because... Jackie uh, 
from Masters of Malaysian Cuisine works at Lenovo and she got us a free laptop. So that was a replacement laptop. In terms of our really good camera, we just got a GoPro and we're just doing simpler vlogs. Yeah. We used to have such a good camera, but it's probably not necessary for this job anyway. So it is what it is. Oh, someone's doing boxing. Boxing in the street. Oh, let's go it watch that. Reminds me of That sounds exciting. Shout out to Farrell. This is pretty cool. It's like an outdoor training and he's, uh, He's boxing in the street. Oh, it's a training. It's a, it's a, yo, this is cool, man. Show it to Farrell. If Farrell were here, he would be able to critique the form, see if the guy's got good, uh, good head movement. Farrell, when we, we did boxing training, he always told me that, Steve, we're not punching, we're boxing. Because I'm very good at punching, but I'm very bad at boxing. So he said, Steve, you're not boxing, you're punching, dude. And so that was my uh, key thing to, key thing to remember. Oh, this is a huge fountain, no? Wait, what is it? Fountain? Yeah, it's supposed to be, but no water. Fountain? No, I think it's fire. Oh, fire. Oh, it is maybe fire. What is this, guys? You guys know? I think this is fire, babe. Some sort of like Olympic torch, you know? Like you start over here and it goes... And it goes... Right. Flame. Yeah, I think flame. Uh, oh, Dodo might have the right answer. It's a fountain of fire. Boom. Both. We're both right. I think it's for flames. Either way, it's out now. Nice park, though. You're right. I think it's flame. I think it's flame. Because the top part looks all burnt up over there. Let's check yeah. it out. Let's check it out. Hold on. For the Asian game, maybe. Oh, Ivana says fountain for the Asian games. Maybe. Yeah, maybe right. Cool. Okay, let's go spy on this guy boxing class. That sounds fun. And we'll make our way to the... Oh, we can go in this park here, babe. Let's go in here. Looks good in here, no? This another park? Okay, yeah, let's go over there. Out. Looks good. Fire, fire, fire. Yeah, everyone says fire. So, Sunshine Girl says bad karma for those who did it. Yeah, bad karma for the uh, thieves, but it is what it is. We probably shouldn't have had such a nice camera, but it was fun to have. It was such good video. I'm not really critical for like frequently uploading YouTube videos. Just need a GoPro, really. But uh, it was fun to, fun to use. Look at these guys. Oh, man. <sighs> Okay, pretty cool. Pretty, pretty cool. So we've got some good videos coming. Uh, we have some interesting ideas. We will go to North Jakarta, which is on the ocean, because there are beaches near Jakarta, yeah. in Jakarta, yeah. that are kind of good. Yeah. So we might like we might do some vlogs to like, is this Jakarta or Bali? Oh and find a good beach and show it uh so we've got lots of video ideas we actually filmed a video this morning and now we're doing live stream jakarta is really good for youtube i would recommend because there's so much stuff going on you can just walk down the street and that's a video what do you think about the weather the it's weather it's hotter than malaysia no? it's hotter than malaysia yeah yeah it's hotter than malaysia I because i think we're closer to the equator Hot. Like right it's hot now, right you're, now. You're talking very slowly. Yeah, it's good for my it's good for my ADD, like... isn't it? <laughs> yeah. When the weather's cold, that's probably why I got ADD. I was born in Canada. <laughs> Usually I talk so fast. Now I'm very calm, aren't I? <laughs> you are. It's not even that I'm calm. It's that I just don't have much energy to get the words out fast. <laughs> Shout out. Shout out. Okay, so we're just cruising around over here. Higher fire and desire. Dun 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 dun. dun. Cool segue, because you guys bring the heat. Yo, the dodos, man. You guys should be vloggers. You guys are coming up with some good ones right now. Is it cooler in Malaysia now? <laughs> uh, Mike is like me. Mike can't take the heat. We're both we're both orang putis that uh, cannot take the heat. But uh, I would say this. I think the dodos would love Indonesia. Yeah. Because they sort of like that counterculture sort of, you know? Yeah. This place Similar has some... Similar to Malaysia, just a little bit more crazy. A little bit more crazy, exactly. Yeah. And the dodos kind of like that feeling, you know? <laughs> they would find some good videos here. They would do some good stuff. Uh, you guys coming into Jakarta? Because if you come, I'll see you here. Then you can follow us to Romania. Hello. And then you can follow us to Romania. Is this a subliminal message, you guys? Uh, maybe it is. Boom. Oh, look at this. You can go stand there, Ivana. Ivana, go stand there. Go oh, stand there. I'm stand there. No. Ivana, go stand there. Ivana, go stand there. Oh, you know what? It is a fountain. Look, the water goes up there. The water goes up to there. And then the water falls into the fountain. This is a fountain. Fire is the wrong answer. Water is the right answer. 
I think so. Is it right? Still not sure. Could be water. Or maybe this is the water. No, no, I think it's fire. No, no, no. I don't know. Liquid fire. Yeah, definitely liquid fire. Oh, look at Ivana. Oh my gosh. Okay, Ivana. Do, do, Ivana, Ivana, Ivana. For the vlog, cover your eyes with your hands and spin around three times fast. Oh gosh. Splash. That would be a fail. Oh, people want to do, Ivana, people want to do the vlog 24 hours only speaking in Bahasa. Okay. okay, we'll do that. Your vlog. Yeah, yeah. Speak Bahasa. Yeah, for Ivana, that's no problem. Okay, I'm gonna try that vlog. Sounds good. Oh, nice view over here, no? Yeah. Shout Zoom out to Jakarta, man. Zoom in a bit. Ivana's a director, you know? There are kids playing uh, roller skating. Rollerblading. Look at this right now. Doesn't seem like the crazy Jakarta that I thought it was. <laughs> this is like this is like nice Jakarta here, man. Yeah. Ten out of ten would live. Now, another video idea. I've been trying to find an ice hockey arena in, in Indonesia, but I can't find. If you guys know where's the ice hockey arena in Jakarta, let me know. Because I would love to uh, play hockey. Or at least go to a hockey arena. Yeah. Oof! Okay, here Gosh. Yeah. Yeah. I still have PTSD from watching Dodo's durian video. Oh, what happened? I think it was okay, no? Maybe yeah. they opened the, maybe they opened the durian wrong. <laughs> That's my guess. Oh, we could put it here and show the Oh, look at that, Ivana. You know why? You see the metaphor here? Because you and I, we got chemistry. We got heat, passion, flames. You know what I'm trying to say? <laughs> Never mind. Oh, look at that doggy. It's so cute. Hello. I will say this. Indonesian people like boules, man. <laughs> True, right? They're very friendly, right? Very friendly to boules. Very bullies. friendly. They're kind of shy, but friendly. If you guys remember when yeah. we went to Indonesia or tried to go from from Sarawak and all the bu all the people were freaking out, it's a bully, oh my gosh. <laughs> it's not quite on that level in Jakarta, but it's a little bit no, like that. No, because it's a big city. <laughs> They've seen it if before. If you come to like a smaller town, maybe that will happen. Uh, but in Jakarta... Yeah, Malaysians are not. more used to bully. Jakarta is pretty used to it, but they're still very... Some of them are still like, hey, bully! And you're like, yeah, man, I'm, that's me. No, because in Jakarta, there are also other tourists from many parts of Indonesia. Local tourists, domestic tourists. Oh, that's That why. comes to Jakarta. So it's a small town guy who's in Jakarta. <laughs> yeah. Who's like, Bule! <laughs> it's always fun. Okay, let's walk. Okay. Want to go towards the bridge? Yeah, sure. Okay. What time is it? We might be there too early. We can stop for a drink. Yeah, let's go towards the bridge. Okay, we're gonna make our way towards a very cool bridge. It's kind of far away. I'm not sure we'll make it all the way there. But no, it's only 20 minutes. 20 minutes? Yeah. Okay, we'll make it there. My mouth is so dry, it's starting to hurt. It's kind of a bit early though. Alright, let's head towards the uh, the bridge and stop for a drink on the way. Maybe a cheeseburger or something. Oh, now the bridge is so nice. Oof. My favorite food in Indonesia is gado gado. Now. Gado gado is the peanut salad, isn't it? Yes, salad, peanut sauce. Isn't there anchovies in it? No, there's no anchovies in it. What's the one that has anchovies in it? Salad. Salad that has anchovies? Little tiny shrimps in it. I don't know. I think it's gado gado. No, it's not that. I think there's shrimp in gado gado. No, there isn't shrimp. Okay, let me know. If it's your favorite food, tell me what's in it. I think I've had gado gado before, but I remember having some salad that had like fermented shrimp in it. Really? And I took one big bite and I have- Maybe uh, it's I have rujak. A, I'm not sure what it was, but I remember I took one big bite. I didn't look at it first and then I was like- I think it's rujak. In bad shape after that. You guys need a fresh tropical drink. Correct. Oh, what's happening there? Correct. Where? The tents, but it looks quiet. No, that's a music festival. Really? Well, anyway, this is kind of like... Oh, drinks. This is sort of like uh, 
surprising for me because my impression of Jakarta is always craziness. This is nice. This is like uh, livable. Quite livable. Be honest, Ivana. Okay, be honest. You're born and raised in Indonesia. Born and raised in Jakarta. Mm -hmm. Is Jakarta livable for you? Would you enjoy to live here? Living here? Or would you prefer to live in Canada? Canada, maybe. Really? Yeah. Now, why? Because there's lots to love about Jakarta. It's a good. It's because going out in Jakarta is a mission. That's what I noticed too. <laughs> yeah. Getting around the city, it takes patience. Yeah. Because it never, from A to B, there's always five different obstacles. What is this? The M is like McDonald's. The M is like McDonald's. <laughs> So I would say Jakarta is great for travel and it's possibly livable, but you got to have good patience because it's slow getting around. Right. You want to grab a drink there? Can. Or... No, I need a drink, Ivana. My mouth is so dry, I'm going to hurt myself. You got water? Let's go there. You got water in your hand. Ivana. Where are you going? Sit over there? You want or no? Ole. Where are we going to start walking? Let's start walking. Here, take this for a second. Yeah. Uh, all right. You and Ivana have passion because Ivana know how to get a great Mitch. <laughs> oh yes, Sarah. Coconut. Or watermelon would be good right now, but I don't see any coconuts or watermelon. It's only, only drinks, only water, only. What did it, What do we have here? Gorengan, kerupuk and gorengan, and me and roti. Okay. What statue is that? Someone is asking. Uno aniki. This is the statue of Bung Karno, which was, I think he was the first president. I gotta go back to my history lesson, but I think he was the first president of Indonesia, I think. I kind of forgot my history. Right. What did you get, Steve? Oh, okay. We can share. You don't want to share. Then get one more. <laughs> get a cold to gold one okay uh ivana you should someone is uh, uh, saying ivana you should try the starling coffee i should let's see if we can find any starling coffee around here the thing is I think the government is not allowing kind of like street food to be sold around this area. So it's kind of hard to find street food here. But we will probably see some Starling coffee on our way to the bridge. Starling coffee is Starbucks Kaliling. Starbucks Kaliling. Kaliling is going around. So there is a like a people who are selling drinks on bikes and it's called Starling Coffee. Another example of Indonesian people taking two words make a new word. Yes. Starbucks Kaliling Starling. Yeah. <laughs> the new one we learned was Mugger. Malas Gerak, Mager. Mager. <laughs> Malas Gerak. Malas Gerak, Mager. Let's go somewhere. Ga, Mager. <laughs> Short form. It's like you're, yeah. it's like texting. Indonesian people speak like a text. Yeah, I'm not sure if Malaysian people will understand if we say, uh, let's go somewhere, jalan jalan yuk, ga mager. I'm not sure if you guys will understand that. <laughs> Let us know. Okay, let's go to the Jambatan, Steve, but I don't know which way it is. Now I'm lost. Oh, well, same. Where are we? Let's go back to the first spot where we came from. All right. Wait, did you grab my pokari sweat? Okay. Pokari sweat. Pokari sweat is actually a Japanese drink. It's like 100 plus. I think there's some in Malaysia too. 
<laughs> I thought Starling coffee is something like Luwak. No, it's not. The cell is just like instant coffee. And this is Steve's. Steve wants to show you guys all the bikes. Lots of bikes here in Jakarta. Yo, uh, petrol, gas in Canada, super cheap in Indonesia. Hmm. Because same like Malaysia, it's subsidized by government. It's it... 7500 for a liter. 7500 is like 75 cents Canadian. Hmm. Less than that. It's like 65 cents Canadian. Which makes it like 50 cents American per liter. Very affordable. So many people have this, and for a dollar or two, you probably, no, fill it for five bucks or something. Right. Or less. Drive all day. <laughs> Good. <laughs> oh boy, I'm tired, man. Yo, it, it I didn't plan. Energy, no? I didn't plan to walk around. I was just supposed to sit in a park. <laughs> My goodness. Karaoke is Kara. Well, oh, I never heard of that one, but maybe it's true. Indonesian style. Yeah, Indonesian yeah. style. Indonesians are very busy people. <laughs> yeah, man. Easy to say the whole word, man. Yes, that's right. <laughs> we got also ember, emang bener. That's true. That one again. Oh, 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 there's a viral TikTok video that is going around right now. Steve might find this funny. Where it says like, Indonesian don't say, I told you so, or I told you so. We just say Khan. Khan? Yeah. What's Khan? Khan, when I, for example, you're doing something wrong and I told you not to move the glass into the other spot because it will, it will fall and splatter everywhere. Yeah. And then it happened. Yeah. You moved it. Yeah. And then in English, we would say, I told you so, why did you do that? Yeah. In Indonesia, we'll just look at you and say Khan. Khan. And just by saying that, you'll be guilty. <laughs> <laughs> I don't okay, know. So what, is it a word or just a sound? Just a uh, word and sound. Can can. But what does it mean? It doesn't mean anything. That's what it means. I told you so. But it's not an actual word. No, no, no. It's just a, it's just it's something you say and people yeah. know it. Or say, yes, sunshine girl is like like C. Oh, like C. Like. Oh, okay. Like see? to can. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's one of those situations where most of the communication is non-verbal. Ah. It's like a, it's like a part of language. Gone. Yeah. It's like, look what you did. Like, see what happened? Uh-huh. <laughs> yeah, Malaysian. Oh, people are saying, people are saying that it's the same in Malaysia. Same? Yeah. Ah, okay, okay. Ah. Honestly, I listen and understand Indonesian song, but when they talk, especially fast, I don't understand much. Sometimes at all. Yeah. Oh, you guys, you can see a little bit of the stage here. Oh yeah. Of the music festival. Oh. But honestly, I don't see anybody there. Hmm. Okay. Let's continue. Honestly, I am lost. I don't know where we are. is this oh this is the music festival okay right here oh probably is it a rehearsal not sure people are selling tickets already so I'm not sure hmm. interesting Look at that. the most random hand wash station I ever saw yes this is uh, because of COVID Oh. So they put all of these uh, random sinks everywhere in the city or in G GBK area. Let's see. Okay, let me let us take you guys to the bridge now. The really cool bridge. Really, really cool bridge. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Ready. Do you know the way? I'm kind of lost. I'm ready. Okay. No, no, I'll give you a good one. All right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Pumba. Right, I'm back. Dun, 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 dun. We saw the KFC and then it's that way. Okay, let's go that way. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, cruising at 150 people in the chat. Not bad for a, a live stream fail. Sort of manageable. Oh, the dodos are going off on their own live stream. Oh, okay. Our numbers might go down. Okay, that's life. Oof. Uh, we gotta go back to the way we came from. A little bit lost, no, Ivana? Are you a little bit lost? Be honest. Yes. Pretty good looking city, though. Can we cross? Let's go cross. Oh my gosh, Ivana's running across the road. Alright. Trying not to get hit by a car in Jakarta. On a live stream. Go, 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 go. Under, 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 under. Easy peasy. Oof. All right, there you have it. So the question is, what other cities are you going to in Java? So we have a couple ideas lined up. There's a place called Bandung, which we think we will go to. We also are thinking of going to, which other place? Jogja. Jogja, of course, of course. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you. Yeah, thank you. Oh, a shout out to the man with a whistle. Life-saving man with a whistle. So Jogja for sure, which is a very unique place that I've been trying to go to every time we came here, but we keep getting too busy, as well as Bandung. And then we'll do Thousand Islands, and then we'll do North Java and the beaches up there. The thing is, we only have 30 days visa on arrival. And we've got tons of other plans for the year. And also we want to spend time with Yvonne's dad, who's here in Jakarta. So we won't be going all around Java. We'll do what we can. What do you see? recognize any of these guys? Oh, this is the artist in the music festival. Yeah, I don't know. Malik Cute do Essentials you guys know band. Any of them? I I D G I T A F. I don't give. I D G I T A F. Bechel, I think Bechel is very famous in Malaysia as well. Do you guys recognize any artists? I was hoping I'd see at the Dow. Bechel is a Bunga Chitra Lestari. She's also famous in Malaysia, I think. Don't know them. Ah, uh, maybe. Maybe you guys know some of those people. I think it would be hard for us to live stream in there. It's probably copyright and stuff, so they might get mad at us for filming. Okay. Probably won't let you film. So we cannot live stream there, unfortunately. I will say this. What a nice part of Jakarta, dude. I did not realize Jakarta was so nice like this. Oh, a KFC truck is bumping. I think focus on certain things you guys want to do. You can do other things when you come again in the future. Yeah, DNTK is right. What's that? Uh, it just says focus on what you want to do. So you're right about that. This is sort of our vacation. Obviously, we're still working and filming every day, but we mainly came, or we also came to see Ivan's dad. So it's sort of relaxing for us, crashing at Ivan's dad's house. And, uh, you know, hanging out with Ivana's family. Okay? Okay. Yeah. I just threw my water bottle in his uh, leaf bin. So it's leaves and water bottles only. Boomba. Okay, Ivana. Next stop, we're guys, we're going to a place. Oh, oh, let me spin around. We're going to this a place. This is a picnic spot, isn't it? This place is bumping, dude. I think there's supposed to picnic inside of the park but since the park is closed yeah this is park overflow they do it outside this is park overflow <laughs> nice little place here and the sun is sort of going down so you get the long shadows it's so nice the other time when you were playing chess Ivana mentioned thousand island any plan to do a vlog from there yes we are going to a thousand island it will happen hopefully more than one vlog so stay tuned in that. Now, Ivana, a thousand islands is actually one thousand islands. Yeah, Pulau Seribu. Or it's just many islands. Oh. Is there actually a thousand? I think I have no idea. I think there are a thousand islands. This, there. Is, this is where, north of Jakarta. Yeah, north of Jakarta. Really? Ah, uh, so interesting that the capital city, which is known for uh, Machat and big oh, industrial city, uh, also has so many islands. Uh, kind of nice. Kind of jealous being Canadian. <laughs> Okay, we're gonna try to cross here. When in doubt, follow the locals. And they will 
get you across. Oh, Ivana, actually, a thousand islands is a few hundred islands. The hand, the hand, the hand, the hand. The power of the hand. So hand right, and then, and then, hand left. Oh, hand right, hand left. Ivana, talk to the hand, okay? All right, the shadows are getting long. So our plan now is to go to a really cool bridge that Ivana and I have already been to. We didn't realize it was so good, so we made a vlog when we were there. But at the time we were there earlier, we did not bring the drone. Yeah. So we now brought the drone with us. We will get some drone footage for our previously recorded vlog. Look at the sun going down. The colors are just popping. I think these photographers would call it uh, golden hour. Just jamming out here in Jakarta. Bunch of happy people out here. Picnic for pizza. <laughs> Which pizza? Over Someone there. Oh, they got pizza. Best picnic ever. Boom, boom. Woo! Ivana can do some. Can Ivana do gambalan? Can you do gambalan? Gambalan. You played it before. Is it gambalan or gambalan? Gambalan. Oh, I don't know what that is. Not sure. Okay, so Ivana's not sure what gambalan is. Maybe you mean gamelan, the instrument. Ding dong, ding dong. Which I have played before, but I'm no good. And Ivana's never played. Gumball, gumball, G U M B A L. I have no gumball. I don't know what that is. Sounds like it sounds like it's a game. It sounds like an Indonesian word. Uh, gumball. Can you do gumball? Gumball, gumball. Can you, can you chew gum? <laughs> don't know what that is, Pico. So I guess I guess no is the answer. Is it a short form or something that I don't know? It's to be probably. Honest, I just learned all this work. It's okay? probably two words. Gom is probably a word for short form, and ball is probably a word for short form. I just learned all this word from my cousin. <laughs> uh, it means flirt in Indonesian. Oh. Did you know that? I did not know that. Uh, anyway, Ivana, do you do do you do flirting? Only with me. Hi, Steve. Only with me. Fair. Okay, guys, we're back to the main road here, and then we will. Uh, go to a cool bridge that inspired us to think that Jakarta was like Tokyo. It's pretty futuristic. It's got the bright lights going and it's pretty cool. Steve, you have a thousand islands in Ontario. That's true. A uh, thousand islands, Ontario. A uh, thousand islands, Ontario. I think it's up near Bruce Peninsula or up near, what's that island called? What thousand island in, in Canada? It's up near what's the island called? Man, Man Manitoulin. Oh, Manitoulin. It's up near I thought, Manitoulin. I thought you were talking also about thousand island in Canada. We also have it in Canada. I forgot until now. I lost my Canadian passport. I think. Uh, <laughs> I forgot about thousand islands in Canada until the chat told me, which is a bit of a fail. Steve, you need to explore your own country. You're right, but you got to be rich to explore that country, so it's very hard. Uh, okay, now we're back in the street, and you guys can see we are in. Is this New York or Jakarta? Is this New York or Jakarta? Oh, look at that image. Is this New York or Jakarta? The thousand island I know is for salad. Yes, Meja. Good joking. I made the same joke before. What is it? The thousand, I thousand islands I know is from salad. So this is a nice place that Ivana and I wanted to show you on live stream. There was a big park, but we had to kind of freestyle. So our idea was first half of live stream in the park, second half of live stream on the nice street here. So we have now begun the second half of the live stream. Uh, um, what was I going to say? That's something good to say. Oh, it? I know what it was. Someone said I miss you in Brazil. Yo, we're coming to Brazil soon. We should be 90% sure in Brazil to watch World Cup where Canada will record its first ever victory. And maybe, if we're not that lucky, oh, this is we can Starling. at least score our first ever goal. Uh, Ivana said, this is Starling. Oh, Harley Davidson. This is Starling. Hello. So what's the idea, Ivana? It's uh, instant coffee on a bicycle. This is, uh, this is called Starling. <laughs> yeah. This Starbucks is hot, hot water on the back. Starbucks Kaliling. Yeah. So they call it, uh, they call it like uh, traveling Starbucks. Not really. 
Starbucks Kaliling. Good idea for a local entrepreneur. Uh, are you getting iced? No, cannot. Can? <laughs> Pretty cool. It's even got ice. Wow, Ivana. Now this is a good business idea. Convenient instant coffee. He's even got ice and a straw. Boomba. Does Jakarta have trains? So there is an MRT. Actually, last time we were here. Oh, good one. My 50 cent Starbucks. <laughs> 50 cent Starbucks Kaliling. Mm -hmm. Boomba, good one. So not last time we were here, but the- Starling, Starling. Starling. Now, the first time we were here, like four years ago or five years ago was when the MRT was brand new. And so we actually did a video on our channel about the MRT. And that was back in the day when nobody was watching our channel. Right. And that video on the MRT got like 30,000 views. And we felt like we were the most famous people who ever lived. So I know for sure the MRT was brand new at the time. So the MRT is about five years old. Now we are planning another video about transportation because Jakarta has the biggest busway in the world. Yes. True, right? The longest. The yeah. longest busway in the world. And so the busway is kind of cool. It's bridges above the road, and they're just like uh, asphalt bridges, like normal bridges you would drive a car on. And so they just drive buses around, no cars allowed, buses only above the city. My idea, or my guess, would be in 10 years or 20 years, they'll all be uh, electric. Starling, and it'll be quite quite affordable and quite clean and quite quiet. There's one more Starling. Hello. Local guy cruising around, making some money selling coffee to the folks. Not bad. Hey, speak of the devil, electric bus. Yeah. So there are some electric buses. Uh, and this is actually a busway here, no? Yes, right here. Yes, so this is part of the busway. This one's on the ground. This is one of the stops right here. One of the stops. And so you can see it's got its, it's, got its own lane and uh, the buses only drive there. Although a lot of the busway is up in the air. So we will do a busway review. Uh, when they're all electric, it'll be super duper nice because it'll be quiet and clean and uh, pretty great. So shout out to Jakarta. Woohoo! So I think what's happening as we post more and more videos, we gotta cross the street. I think what's happening is my mother is getting more and more excited to come to Indonesia and Jakarta. Indonesia and Malaysia. So I'm pretty excited too for next year's trip with my mama. Nurul Iman. We will be staying in uh we will be staying in Java this time. In Jakarta mostly. And we will uh, make lots of vlogs because Jakarta is a really nice city for vlogging, man. There's stuff all around. I think we can cross over there, Ivana. I will say, I didn't realize Jakarta was so green. Surprisingly green. And lots of bicycle lanes is true. Let's cross with him. Okay, fair. Oh, I thought that I thought that light on the ground was actually paint. We're gonna have to just make it happen, Ivana. Okay. Now this is uh, one of the harder parts of Jakarta. Just getting across the road. It's not too bad, but the power of the hand really works. Wanna go? Made it. Whenever you're in doubt, trying to cross the road. Just uh, just look at the locals and follow them. Oh, this is a really nice thing. I want to fly the drone here after. This is a really cool thing. They call it uh, they call it the clover. 
Is it the clover, right? Yeah, the clover makes me confused all the time. It's very confused to walk around the clover. Yeah. It's a road going north-south and a road going east-west. And in order to connect all the roads, they did this looping sort of, uh, what is that, 270 degree turns on all four corners. And so from the, uh, from the sky, it looks like a clover. So on Google Maps, it looks amazing. Now maybe you can't see it from here, but this is one of the clover pieces. It goes all the way around. And so it's a super massive, uh, perfectly symmetrical cross with curls on each side. And so I will fly the drone over here maybe a different day because today we are in the middle of something talking to you folks so like i was saying earlier i think my mom is getting quite excited to come to indonesia and malaysia so i'm really looking forward to next year <laughs> when my mom comes and hopefully ivana's mom will be here too that will really be something special because i think she's gonna have so many funny things to say it'll be her first time ever coming to the other side of the world like this so I think she'll have a total kick out of it. Oh, hold on, I gotta ban this guy here. Uh, there we go. Okay, sorry, we had a spam of best adult dating site. So that was a must ban situation. So as you can see here, yeah, block that fella. Uh, this, is, this is one of the petals of the clover. And so that's only one and there's four of them and they're all on each side and it looks like a million bucks from the sky now people are saying is jakarta walkable jakarta is uh tremendously walkable in terms of it's very safe i have the phone out obviously now i have the drone with me we bring the gopro everywhere so jakarta is very safe the only reason it's kind of not walkable is because it's super duper hot so for a guy like me from like from like noon to 3 30 Usually, I'm um, not doing much of anything. But in terms of safety, totally walkable. In terms of uh, accessible uh, shops and everything, totally accessible. And they also have these guys doing favors for you, which will help us get across the road. Thank you, thank you. Okay, good. Uh, actually, where we're going now, hello, this looks like Sao Paulo. Yo, a lot of people are saying that, Ivana. <laughs> Ivana commented that in one of our videos, and it's true. There are parts of Jakarta that really remind us of Sao Paulo. Yeah. And uh, just me, we were walking the other day and there's a bunch of, they have this new trend in, in Jakarta where people, um, they wear really, really nice clothes and they do like a fashion show, just them with their friends. And then these little fashion shows keep getting more and more, people keep adding more and more to them. So we were walking along just randomly and we saw like a fashion show, it also had live music, it also had people dancing, it also had like full head to toe beautiful costumes and it was totally reminding us of Brazil or Sao Paulo because it was like, you know, they had like live drums, sort of like a samba, sort of like a carnival. Uh, it was only like 30 or 40 people, but just the fact that it was happening all by itself, it was like, it was like amazing. So yes, you're right, it does remind us of, uh, Sao Paulo. Now, I am Meow was asking, where are we going now? There's a really cool thing they've built up here because this is one of the main roads in Jakarta, sort of like a highway. And so there's all these pedestrian bridges that go across. And so one of the pedestrian bridges, for whatever reason, this particular one, they've got lights in all the walkways and lights in all the handrails that do like a kind of pattern, as well as they've built like a huge balcony and it's like a really good viewpoint. It's a really great hangout spot. And during the day, it's not too special because the lights don't show. But once the sun goes down, uh, it's a really cool, it's a really cool spot to be. So I think we've got like an hour before the sun goes down, but at least when, starts, when the sun starts going down and it starts getting dark, we will see something quite special. It's only like 10 minutes more walk, 20 minutes more walk, but we can sit up there. We can sit up there and, uh, show you guys the cool series of bridges um as you can see it's a nice looking city my first impressions of jakarta were mostly that street market where ivana lives and so it's been nice to explore more uh 
developed, or not developed, but just more like uh, modern areas. Also, we have shot, we have shot the video about uh, financial districts, which you guys might like that video because. How are we gonna cross this road, Ivana? We're gonna have to run. We're gonna have to get ready for it and run. Dun, 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 trying to cross this road. Okay, okay, let's go up here more. Go, 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 right now, right now, right now, right now. Run. Ole, Ivana, safety, safety. Now, I would even say this kind of reminds me of some sort of Brazilian thing, South American. Brightly colored flag, it's all funny, cut in a funny way. Uh, sort of carnival-like. What is this for, do you know? Sort of carnival-y, you know? Carnival-ish. Kind of, right? Nice place. So, uh, Boomba. Let's, uh, let's do it, guys. We're maybe 10 minutes to the bridge. The bridge is pretty nice. It's sort of similar to these, uh, these bridges here, except it's just done up really nice. And so, I think you guys will enjoy it. And you can see all the huge buildings, man. Just nice. Just nice. So, so far so good in, uh, in Jakarta. I will say it was funny that Ivana had some stomach problems because of the Indonesian spice level. She was eating as if she never left, but her stomach left. So it's quite funny to see uh, Ivana ha realizing the food is spicy in, uh, in Jakarta. Oh, shout out to Fateh Noor. Thank you very much for the donation. There's a thank picture you, in, your, you. in your donation. There's thank a, you. In your picture, there was a... Uh, uh, in your donation, there was a picture of a burger. And we will try to find a burger. Ivana and I actually had the biggest fail ever for a burger hunt in uh, a video you'll see shortly. We really wanted to try some burgers. Oh, because Ivana had stomach problems, she didn't want to have any spicy food, so she wanted to find a, a Western sort of familiar burger. And um, it took us like two hours to find one, and then it was only a and W in the end. But uh, thanks for your donation. And hopefully we'll find a better burger. I see no pedestrians. Where is everybody? Uh, good question. Uh, for one, it is Sunday. And so actually the least traffic in terms of foot traffic or cars happens on Sunday. So Ivana and I were actually driving with Ivana's dad earlier today. And it was not so bad to get around. Because uh, it's Sunday. Also, we're sort of on the side of the highway, which maybe is not the most walkable place. You see, we got this little tiny, oh my gosh. Yeah, move your feet here. And we're sort of in the highway. So maybe this is why we don't see any people. There are some people up in the bridge there. But this is life. What's that? We're stuck, in we're stuck over here. This is a bit of a fail, Ivana. This is a bit of a huge fail. Okay, guys, we've now started the Daredevil, Evil Knievel, American Ninja Warrior portion of our live stream. We're gonna run. Oh, good timing, good timing. After this guy, after this guy. Oh, maybe not, maybe not, maybe not. One more, wait, 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 wait. Oh, one more. Oh, Waiting. <laughs> Shoot, should have ran. Okay, when I run, I gotta make sure the phone doesn't fall off the tripod. We're gonna be in deep trouble. Come on. Okay, here's a hole, here's a hole. Yeah, he's a hole. Easy peasy. Police. First thing we see. Go to jail. Okay, we're good. Go, 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 go. Woo. Okay. Almost there. I promise you, 10 minutes of the bridge. It's a very cool place. It reminded Ivana of Tokyo. So we had a little bit of Brazil with the dancing and music show. Then we had a little bit of Tokyo with the fancy technology bridges. And now my Indonesian wife is stuck in the middle of Indonesian traffic. <laughs> Woof! Steve, try to look out for a store that sells burkotok. Okay, 
Okay, I'll, I'll ask uh, Ivana what that is. Shout out to Casey Lou. Thank you very much for the donation. My hat is doing something freaky. Uh, your picture says on set. Uh, something like a movie being filmed. So we will use your donation to save for a new camera when ours breaks. Uh, donation from Casey Lou. Casey Lou donation. Uh, Pico 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 says don't Thank hesitate. You. By Thank the way, you, guys, Casey. did you notice that the non Indonesian crossed the street better than the Indonesian? Yes. <laughs> Let's go. Someone was helping me on a motorbike. He really? Was, he was stopping the traffic. Really? Yeah. Oh, I didn't see. Yeah, he so slowed nice down guy. and then he did this. He really? Went like this. He blocked it for you? Yeah. Oh, so nice guy. Shout out to Indonesians, man. I like them. I tell you what, Ivana, I like Indonesians, man. <laughs> They're all right. Is the Tugu Monas far from where you are now? Let's be honest. Tugu. Yeah. Tugu is a word, two words, no? Let me guess the two words. What's Tugu? Tugu is a statue, a monument. Yeah, Monas is like... Monas is, is Monument National. National. So what's Tugu? Yeah. Tugu is monument. Tugu Monas means Monument National Monument. Yeah, Tugu is like building. That's Gadung. The, like a statue structure almost. structure yes structure. oh okay 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 <laughs> anyway the monument i think is a little bit uh far any plans to go to thousand islands yes well lots of people are asking people about want that. us to go there we are going there so yeah. good uh and we will be going to the one in jakarta not the one in canada oh <laughs> can you jaywalk here it looks like it's not safe I think jaywalking is okay. It might be a little, might be a little rough. They have these bridges, but I think people do it all the time. I don't think a police yeah, officer yeah. would give you a Dangerous. ticket for jaywalking. But I don't think a cop would give you a hard time. Uh, I don't think so. But you might. It's dangerous. Do not try. It's dangerous. Fair. I just tried it and it was hard. You made Very it though. Very challenging. You made it. But they didn't have any bridges back there. So we had to. We yeah, we sort of had no choice. <laughs> yeah. We were walking somewhere that was okay to walk. Yeah. And then it became somewhere not okay to walk. Yeah. We crossed the point of no return. Right. Oh, check it out. Some stray cats. Some lovely cats. Lovely cats. A lot of the cats in Indonesia got no tails. Or half tails. There's a cat with a full tail. Meow. Okay, guys. Almost there. I want to see two gumonas. Okay. What we'll do, everyone keeps talking about Tugu Monas. In an upcoming video, we will try to show Tugu Monas. Uh, yeah, sounds good. Oh, uh, uh, we're renting a bike. Yeah, but they look old. They look old. It's kind of funny because <laughs> it's a new idea usually. Oh, not electric, but it's uh, just a bike. You can rent. Okay. Use your phone probably. Yeah, scan here with your phone. Beep, beep. Cool. Uh, two. <laughs> I am meow says hello, my friend. Meow meow to the cats. Very funny. Show us street food if they have pasar malam equivalent. Yo, we've got lots of street food vlogs coming. We tried three different types of satay. We tried martabak. We tried nasi uduk, which is amazing. Lots of food vlogs coming. If you remember the live stream from a week ago, um, Ivana's house is full of action. You walk out the door and it's just all food, all selling, all market, all the time. Mm -hmm. So lots of street food stuff coming. We're worried that we have too many food vlogs. We're trying to space them apart with adventure vlogs because, I mean, food is like is like a passion in, in, in Indonesia. It really is. Yeah. Same like Malaysia, the food is a passion. They just don't serve you food where they just don't care. They, even if it's a dollar or less than a dollar, they really try hard to make it as best they can in a really passionate way. Correct, correct. Correct. And so, yeah, we have lots of street food vlogs coming. Um, lots and lots and lots. Is the temperature in Jakarta hotter or colder compared to Kuala Lumpur from Fateh Noor? Uh, I would say hotter. 
something it, it's hotter. In terms of temperature, it might be similar, but it's so humid over here in Jakarta. Yeah. It makes you tired because it's sweaty. And so I would say it's hotter in Jakarta. Also, I think the air quality is not as good. And I think air quality affects hotness level. I'm not a, I'm not a meteorologist, but my understanding of how I feel in different countries is when it's really fresh, it doesn't feel as hot. And when it's a big city, it's kind of got lots of, lots of motorbikes going, lots of engines, lots of industry, it seems hotter. That's right. So for all these reasons combined, I think Jakarta is hotter than, uh, than KL. Ivana says, look at this cute cat. Whoa, it meowed at you in an angry way. That was an aggressive meow. Oh, okay. Don't mess with that cat. Uh, the idea is combine the food vlogs and preferably add Google Maps pin so we can go there. Um, so it's not a bad idea. The Google, come on, Steve-O, there it is. The Google Maps pin would be a good idea, can do. Combining them can be a bit, um, we find it better to do them separately because one title and one thumbnail, uh, when you have five or six different foods in one video, it's really hard to decide which title and which thumbnail. Right. So it's better to have three or four. You know, doing two or three foods is okay in one video, but if you do 10, just so many of them don't get seen. But anyway, we'll try to add the Google, um, Google Maps, Maps pin is a good idea. Uh, wait, Just Me has a good question and I actually don't know. This has been embarrassing. Are you in the Southern Hemisphere? <laughs> Do you know? <laughs> Ivana doesn't even know of her hometown in the Southern Hemisphere. Let me think about this. The, the equator. Oh man. I think we're in the Southern Hemisphere. I have no idea. I think we're in the Southern Hemisphere. I'm sure the chat will know. My guess would be Jakarta is in the Southern Hemisphere, but the, the equator is just right near here. But I think Jakarta is in the Southern Hemisphere. Oh, that's a good question. I don't really know. Yes, JK is in Southern Hemisphere. Phew, got it right, bit of a guess. Oh, shout out to Remedy, nice donation. Hello, hello, thank, thank you, you so very, much. Very, very much. We really appreciate the donations. It does a lot for us. Yes, you guys know you. we are trying our best to continue traveling and making videos. And so, yes, thank you very much. It really, really helps. Every dollar, every ringgit, every single Japanese yen really, <laughs> really helps. And so it is quite nice now because the sun is going down and the heat is going away. And it is nice view, no? Oh, nice place. Maybe here. Oh, right there. Oh, nice place. Hello, and your flowers from Sandakan, Sabah. Shout out to Ismawati from Sandakan. Oh, look at this building. Shout out to... Oh yeah. Something's going on right here. This building is blowing cold air. Oh, it's from the metro right here. Oh, you know what this is? This is like some kind of air air thing for the metro. And it's blowing cold air. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. We should put a Google Maps pin right here. Coolest part of Jakarta, right here. <laughs> oh, it feels so good. Coolest part of Jakarta. Because there's an underground metro. Which is part of the MRT or no? MRT. So this is the one that was brand new when we were first here. Uh, or, or I should say I was first here uh, five years ago. MRT here? Yeah. Bus way there. Starling. Yo, these starlings are all over the place. You will not walk a very long time looking for a coffee in Jakarta. Yeah. In Jakarta, that coffee comes to you. That's right. Boomba. All right, guys, almost there. Bang, bang, bang. Say again? Starling. Bang, bang, bang. Starling. Starling. Yeah. Nice. So what a lovely walk. 
this is going to be, as it turns out, a record live stream because I feel good still going. It's already been an hour and 25. We've been walking a lot. I don't mind. Yeah. We can keep it going because the bridge up here is worth seeing. I hope so we're not it'll be a bit of a delay, but it's worth it. How can I remember? Did and you card a sign? Say again. The Jakarta sign. The Jakarta sign. Okay, very nice. Just nice. Now, it's so funny in the chat, we are cruising at 150 people, pretty steady. And I don't know if people are coming and going or mostly the same people. Oh. Interesting, right? It's pretty steady, 140 to 160, almost well, walk. you guys are here since the beginning of our live stream. Thank you. This guy back again. <laughs> you bought a scam. What did I write? What did I click? Report. Report. There you go. Ah, uh, here we go. Oh, reporting. First one. No. Okay. Both. Can I put two? No. No, just one. Okay. That's good. Report. Okay. Good. Okay. Oh, last time I just hid him from the channel, but this time I hid him and I reported him. There you have it, guys. No YouTube channel, no space of the internet is free from robots who are spamming nonsense. This is part of it. Okay, I can see the bridge. We are there very shortly. Can't see. Can't see. I will say this too. Jakarta seems very safe because there's cops everywhere. Yes. Does Indonesia have mandatory military service? No. No. I don't think so. Uh, I thought maybe no. it did. If it did, maybe my brother would have to come back. I have no idea. Oh, good question. Yeah, I guess they don't. It seemed like Jakarta, I should say Indonesia, might have had mandatory military service because I find a lot of countries where there's cops everywhere have military service that's why they have so many cops because so many people are trained on how to be you know use a gun and stuff how to become good effective police force anyway almost at the bridge so we will show you guys this nice place maybe we can find another cold drink and we can watch the, the so sunset nice. two people help uh, us cross already the police are nice the police yeah the police help us cross the street they always seem very good at their job. Yeah. Some countries, the cops are like on their phone, having a cigarette and don't care. That's true. The Indonesian police seem to be very attentive and very uh, professional. That's right. That's been my experience at least. <laughs> well, of course, there are bad police and good police everywhere. Of course, but yeah. I just think in general, it's pretty, it's pretty good, uh, safe and clean and nice place. So here we are. What does Jakarta mean? Google says complete victory. Whoa, is that right? Oh, maybe. I think there is a meaning because that's perfect. Complete victory, interesting. Do you know if it has a meaning, babe? I think there is, uh, because the old name for Jakarta used to be Batawi. Batawi? Yeah, or Batavia. Oh. In, in Dutch, Batavia. Right, right, right. And then, man, I gotta go back to my history. Uh, let me charge the phone, it's some charging. Uh. I gotta learn my history again. I'm not the best person to ask about Indonesia because I've been out of the country for so long. Well, you left when you were 13. Yeah. Which I means that's probably spent, the age where you start learning that stuff. I spent more time of my life in uh, Canada rather than in Indonesia. Right, right, right. Yeah. Hey, put the hand over there. Oh. Over there. Yeah. Got it. Good. Yeah, it makes sense, Ivana, because uh, Jaya means success. That's true. Mm -hmm. And Karta means city. Oh. So it means like vic victory city, victorious city. Yeah. Complete victory. Okay. That's, that's where you got it from. Okay, it makes sense. Yeah, it's not surprising you don't know this stuff, Ivana, because when you're 10, 11, 12, you probably don't learn it. Right. When you're 13, 14, 15, you probably learned it, but you were in Canada then. Yeah. You left just before the age where people learn this stuff normally. Okay, fair. Now, we've come to the cool place. We were a bit early, so the lights are not on yet. But you can see this cool bridge up here. And it seems like every night there's tourists here. Because we were here the other night, and we quite like this place. It's a nice hangout spot, and I think it's relatively new because it's full of local tourists. Like, not necessarily locals who are just looking at it, 
but like local tourists who are from a different part of Indonesia and got their cell phone and taking photos. Because uh, it looks brand new to me. Okay, fantastic, let's go up there. Let's go up there. Now my range is a bit short because we are charging the phone as we walk. <laughs> Gotta manage it. We're doing two things at once. You should collab with Axan Nation. There's been a few recommendations of people we could collab with. Uh, we're always willing to meet YouTubers, always interested in meeting YouTubers. But we only got three more weeks. Right. So it's gonna have to happen soon. Right. Somebody, or more than a few people, recommended Lost Boys, which was pretty cool. We checked out their channel. There are a bunch of, uh, I think, Americans. No, no, actually. A bunch of boules, and they're doing food stuff and travel stuff. It was pretty cool. Okay, guys, my my energy is going down. You want to vlog for a bit? Well, we'll show them show the them bridge, and then. Yeah, okay, my energy is going down. Oof. So we'll show you this cool bridge here, and then we'll uh, do our thing. Maybe if we can, Ivana, we'll go to Dodo's live stream and make some comments over there. If they're still going, that is. Oof. I think we did pretty good, Ivana. We walked for an hour and a half, which is a lot in Jakarta. So the lights are not on yet, or if they are, you can't see them. But this place up here is pretty sweet, man. Uh, lights are on or off? No, lights are off. But in here, in here, they got really sh bright lights that shine onto the ground and make a little show. And it's a wicked place. You can see they got the balcony up here. It's really a wicked place. Oh my gosh, I'm getting so tired so fast. I just hit a wall. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay, okay, safe, safe, safe. Oh my gosh, so tired. We walk a lot. <laughs> How do you look so good? I look so bad. Yeah. Okay, let's go up. Let's go up. Let's go up. Don't give up. Don't give up. Never give up. Almost there. Let's go to the balcony. You can see everybody out with their photos doing their stuff. Oh my gosh. I am tired, man. I'm finito. Oh, here's a good Instagram photo right there. Very nice Insta photo. Everybody out and about. Woof. How many steps a day on average? Uh, it's a good question, just me. I think 10,000 is healthy. We must average way more than that because we walk a lot. Uh, there are like months on end where the only exercise we do is walking. And so both of us maintain our weight pretty well. We must be well over average because sometimes we eat so much food it's a bit crazy. So this is the place. This is one little viewpoint here. Everybody likes. But behind me is the better one up there. It's really nice. All the walkway all around. It's really something special. So we'll take you up there in a minute. It goes all the way across over there. And it's actually above the road. So it's a pretty great it's a pretty great uh, viewpoint. Oh my god, Ivana. I'm so tired. We're over there. Where? Over there. See it. Oh my gosh. I'm getting tired. Alright. Let's go up and then Okay, let's go up. <laughs> so this is the walkway. Oh my gosh. Don't give up. Never give up. Hello. No. Okay, don't give up. Never give up. Oh, a lot more busier than last time. Yeah, I think because it's Sunday, babe. Oh my gosh. Oh my God, they don't know a famous YouTuber is near them. I think we have no Indonesian followers yet, so we're still anonymous. Uh, here we go. Boop. Here's the viewpoint here. 
I mean, this is a nice place, dude. This is somewhere nice. How's the COVID rules there? Uh, I think indoors, you gotta wear a mask. At the, at the very least, I always have one in my pocket. Uh, certainly in a grab, which is not called grab, it's called gojek. Certainly in a gojek, you gotta wear your mask. Um, but uh, outside, no. Outside is free. There's Ivana, looking very... Oh, looking like a model. Oh, you're happy, you're happy, you're sad, you're sad. You're pouting, you're pouting. You're a tiger. <laughs> Boomba, okay. Hey, have it, guys. Now, I'm gonna unplug this so I can be a little free for the last minute here. Wow, those are... <laughs> Alright guys, what are those that's wings? it for today. Oh, you know what oh, that is? Wings. Those wings. Those are street lights. Yeah, street lights. So they're, just, they're built a bit like wings. Uh, pretty cool spot. To chill. It's kind of crowded. Balcony. Oh my gosh. Right now, the phone is over the road. On a tripod. Eagle street lights. Yeah, right. Absolutely right. So it actually connects both sides of the road. This over here is the elevator. This is like a bike lane over here. This is a walking path. And it goes all the way under and to the far side. So it's pretty cool. I will say this. And at night, stay tuned cool for our video here. Because once the sun goes down, the pathway lights up and puts a little light show. It's very like uh, sequential or psychedelic or trippy. You know, the lights all kind of dance. And so at night it's pretty fantastic in fact the lights just came on right now Ooh, really what timing that was what? if you look closely the lights are on oh yeah it is i guess it's almost sunset time uh the lights just came on if you look real closely see the lights in the, in the handle let me steady the camera for you dun, 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 dun. Oh, no, no no it's gonna work okay look see the lights mm. oh not really not really a little bit all right. Anyway, there are lights, and it's uh, it's pretty sweet at nighttime. Woof! Like a uh, selfie here. Selfie. Which way? This way. Oh, nice view, no? Uh, <laughs> All right. Anyway. Oh my god, I'm sleepwalking. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I'm sleepwalking. All right, there you have it, guys. It's a cool place. Maybe we'll stay going for a bit more until the lights, but I gotta say something for the next bit. I got nothing to say. <laughs> Planet, you gotta watch our vlog. My mouth is dry again. I just had a whole bo bottle of water and a whole very sweat. Oh, you, you. Amazing, 125 people are still watching. We really have fans. Yeah. It's so nice to have <laughs> you guys. Without you guys, nobody would watch, and I would just be a, a freak with the camera. <laughs> but now it's uh, it's right, pretty man. great to be here. Our plan was to stay here until the sun goes down and fly the drone, but I don't know. Man. I think we're too early. I think we're too early. Yeah. Maybe come a different day. Yeah. Oh my gosh, I'm beat up. <laughs> Somehow we're picking up more subscribers now that I'm so tired. I mean viewers. Really? <laughs> yeah, but the 130. <laughs> Didn't see the lights, but saw some cute girls though. <laughs> Good eye, I don't even like... Good. <laughs> yeah, we walked too fast. Alright. What else is new? Put honey on your lips to avoid dryness. Mm -hmm. Bro, that's awesome. Hey, let's keep the vlog going. Got a donation. Ah, thanks, Berta. Berta Chaya. Chaya. Thank you. And the picture is some hearts. Oh, by the way, I want to know. Like, have you guys been to Indonesia? Most of you guys, I think. You guys know a lot about Indonesia, so I am assuming it's because you're from Malaysia or you've been to Indonesia before. Hmm. I think a lot of Malaysians would go to Indonesia. Yeah. Or maybe not. Maybe you wouldn't go to Indonesia because it's kind of similar. And you, if you're going to travel, you want to travel somewhere totally different. Uh, I think lots of Indonesian travel to Malaysia uh. or Singapore. Interesting. I've been to Jakarta many times. I've been to Bandung. Uh, me, Malaysia. Yeah. 
Been there as a student. Oh. I guess it depends the reason you're traveling. Been if you're Bali, traveling of for uh, if you're traveling for an uh, adventure and see something new, you might go yeah. out of it, Indonesia because it's similar. Right. But if you're a student or going to Bali, it's pretty amazing. Right. Or vacation, cool. Yeah, even Bandung and Jakarta is kind of kind of have different vibe. Even Bali is very different than Jakarta, so. I guess. Yeah, that's the good part of Indonesia yeah. as a tourist is every island's got its own feel. Right. I'd love to go to Sumatra. Yeah, Sumatra would be cool. I want to go to Padang to eat my favorite food ever there. What's that? Nasi Padang? <laughs> Nasi Padang. <laughs> well, Nasi Padang isn't even a food. It is food. What do you mean? It is food, but it's not a food. Yeah. Like spaghetti and meatballs, that's a dish. <laughs> Nasi Padang is a collection of dishes. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Right. Not that it's oh, not good. Know, there's, it's, there's rendang in it, there's mm. ba balado, dendang balado, there is uh, green chilies. Green chilies, mm. I am. Mm. I am hop. Nasi padang is good. There is no nasi padang in padang. Really? There is no nasi padang in padang. What? That's like saying there's no pizza in Italy, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. Really? That's something new. I thought you would find more padang food there. That's interesting. Anyway. Majority boogies. The language and food are different. Ah. Okay. So why is it called nasi padang? From padang. Nasi ayam is good. Bubur ayam is expensive. Hey, is nasi padang expensive? Depends where you get it. Yeah. There are rampage, 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 rampage. Yes. Uh, there are places that are really fancy called nasi padang. Uh, and yeah, there are street food. And it, there right? are street food. Street food. The local doesn't call it nasi padang in padang. Oh really? What do they call it? So they have it, but they're different name. Okay. Okay, it's guys. Nasi. The lights are coming on. We're almost there. We're almost there. Look, now you can see the lights. See the lights? Not really. Let's move there a little bit. Where do you want to go? We're in a very uh, popular spot here. You want to go somewhere quieter? Maybe down. down. Okay, okay, can. Maybe we'll keep it going. Oh my gosh, people everywhere. People trying to take a photo. Oh, here's a good view. Dude, check me out right now. This is the place to be right here. You get to see the people down there. Yeah. And up. Yo, shout out to Jakarta, man. Shout out. I'm fading fast, guys. Hello. Hello. Nice little girl. Hey, there's Ivana. Jakarta is massive. True fact. More than 10 million people. I think it was 10 million last time I was here, or more. So it's probably like 12 million now. Was it, Ivana is excited about something. Let's go down there. Bule. Maybe they call it nasi here. Yo, uh, Penjuru Galaxy. I absolutely love your joke. Sorry. Uh, maybe they call it nasi here. This this is great joking. I'm too tired to laugh, but it's very funny. I really appreciate it. Now Ivana was excited about something. Now she's gone. Oh yo yo. Uh, is this like the heart of the city? Uh, that's a good question. I know the financial district is just over there. Those are the big buildings. And so I don't know if it's technically the heart. I also know we're in South Jakarta. So Ivana, would you describe this place as the heart of the city? As what? The heart of the city. Like is it called downtown? Is it uptown? Uh, is it midtown? I don't know what I think it is. this is the financial center of financial the city? Financial center. Yeah. The business center, okay. lots of banks. So maybe not see. the heart, but maybe the wallet. The heart, there's also like Kota Tua part. That's, that might be the heart. I don't know, this is also the heart. Oh, Jakarta Kota Tua. is so big, man. Kota Tua. So Kota Tua is the old town. Yeah. Which might be the historical heart. Like it's like where all the, the Dutch buildings still are and stuff. So that might be like the center of the city from a hundred years ago. But this might be the modern heart. Or maybe that's the heart and this is the brain of the city. Oh, snap, upper class. Yeah. So this is a good spot to chill because the road is right beneath us, which is kind of amazing. And the view is so nice. 
Yeah, the business place says Pico Pico Pico. Uh, yeah, that's the idea. So all over here on the right is uh, financial district. So that's why you got all them big buildings. Yeah. And it's quite, and look at that right there. Bank, capital, over here, bank stuff, you know, financial district. Yeah. We might take the busway later. See, the busway doesn't stop. That's, a, that's one of the station there. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Where is it? Here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my gosh, sorry guys. I almost broke the tripod there. Oof. Cool, man. Okay, what do you say, Ivana? You wanna keep talking? I'm, I'm out of, I'm, <laughs> my mouth is so dry. Hold on. Jareel R-O-G-B Alexander. Hello there. Hello, hello. We got more people joining now. Paddy equals rice. Badass uncooked. Yes. Nasi cooked rice. Nasi cooked rice. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah. Nasi means cooked rice. Yeah. What's that nasi mean? Rice. No, nasi means cooked rice. is the uncooked one. The, ah. What do you call it? In English, it's all just rice, isn't rice, it? Rice, man. Even the uncooked one? Rice. Everything rice. Oh, the bridge is so nice. Oh, the bridge is nice. Would you call this place Bukit Bintang or KLCC? Uh, KLCC. KLCC. Is it near Plaza Indonesia Mall? Uh, yes. Um, so Plaza Indonesia is where we across from where we went yesterday, Grand Indonesia. Oh. Yeah, that mall. So if that's you not walk far. a little bit more, like yeah, 30 minutes far. walk. Yeah, not Maybe far. like five minutes drive. Not yeah. bad. Yeah. It's near there. Neither. Okay, let's end this live stream and let's go crash the dodos. <laughs> everybody, come join us. We're gonna go to the dodos live stream if it's still going. Yeah. But if it is, we'll see you there and we'll bring. Every, listen, everybody, go there and say something about Jet Lag Warriors. Came here from Jet Lag Warriors live stream. Because <laughs> if we all comment, it'll help their live stream. As well as it's just funny that we all go there and flood the <laughs> live stream with. It will be funny. Yeah, let's flood their live stream with. Came here from Jet Lag Warriors. Came here from Jet Lag Warriors. Okay, let's do it. Okay guys, see you there. That's a fun game. Let's go. Thanks for joining. Thank Bye. you, thank you.